Last time on ALP! <laughs> Super Saiyan Block Breaking! Super Saiyan Block Placing! Super Saiyan Block Picking Up! 10. 10. 45. 45. Stack and 49. The stack and 5. <laughs> it's a whole wall of trees! What will happen next? Stay tuned! I had to- this? I had to stop for maternity leave. <laughs> 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 no, I had to stop to be building more, uh, platform. So, I did actually have to stop due to labor. <laughs> so I guess that counts. <laughs> I guess so, yeah. Um, the- up, up, the ah! Here. I was automatically walking forward. See, glitches like this happen all the time! I think it's your- I think you need a better computer, Zach Loud. I really do. I'm- I'm just borrowing my mom's laptop. Oh, there's more. Yeah, oh, well, there's glowstone all over here. All in risky areas. <laughs> this one looks like it's over land, though, so... Oh, yeah, any I think luck, it is. With any luck, I can just break this. If you wanted to go down to the floor and pick some of it up or something. Or you can break it, either way. Um, yeah, I'll probably try going down. Boop. I think we're good with this stuff. Yep. Um, if I... Th Whoop, I missed my thing. Ow, oh. slight wound. That's not too bad, though. If I throw... Can you see me? Yes. I'm going to throw some netherrack over towards the lava. Tell me if it hits the lava or not. Okay. I think that just about did. Um, have you thrown it? Yeah, there it is. Oh. Um, this and <laughs> No! Not again! I don't have you it on my hotbar! Quick, 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 quick! Uh, no! Oh. There goes everything! Oh. <laughs> I forgot to put replace it on my hotbar! Oh, my dear. stupid thing walked forward again, and then I tried to change direction, and then uh, it walked in like the other direction and fell off. Why I does it always off. have to be bullcrap? Why can't I die oh, in no. valiant battle? <laughs> <laughs> uh. I lost all my stuff and all the glowstone I got. Oh no. <laughs> Why couldn't I freaking die fighting? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, uh, well, um, my, my diamond sword and my diamond armor. <laughs> and my potions and. Do you have some backup diamonds? I have three, and I have almost a stack of rotten flesh. Not quite yet, I'm on 58. <laughs> oh, that's pretty close to a diamond. Yeah. It, it, usually it's not this bad, but I've, uh, in some of my upcoming episodes, uh, an automatic walk forward has killed me, and uh, it's happened on uh, my Xbox 360 controller as well as the keyboard, so it's not just the keyboard. <laughs> Do you reckon it's the, actually the laptop then, rather than the keyboard? Could be. Um... Because, like I said, it think it like seems to automatically do things a lot. It thinks that I'm automatically running when I press walk. Sometimes it mm. automatically thinks I'm walking when I'm I've let go of the button, and it often thinks I've double clicked when I single click. That, my mouse is currently doing the double click thing, but I think it is the mouse. I've ordered a new one. Yeah, it seems it's probably the laptop because it happened for pretty much everything on it that I've done. So it probably like stutters all input or something. Hmm. It's not good. Um, what well, a I'm going to come back over to the hub and uh, meet you there. Okay. I can remember how to get back. Man! Half of our spoils! Oh! 
What we should have done is brought an ender chest with us. Then we could have, like, I had, we should do that next time. I Yeah, can... I had regular chests on me in case mm -hmm. I did something risky, but we weren't really doing anything risky. Not at that moment. It was my moment. fault. I told you to go over and check that, the, um... Th that wasn't your fault. I mean, you didn't tell me, hey, make sure your keyboard sticks when you go toward the lava. <laughs> 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 I had a bunch of what on me, and I had uh, one of my regen potions in case I needed it, in case the pigmen got angry, and oh, no. I had my healing potions and my fire potions. I better quit it's whining. Just bull crap. Yep, always is. I'm like stuck. I don't know how to get back. Man, is it we? I don't know. We did. I didn't think we got went that I far. I could just kill myself. That's probably an easy way to get back. No! <laughs> <laughs> then you'll lose your stuff. Two, three, three, five. I've been going the wrong way. That's why. Ah. Oh. I'm like I. I have the coordinates in front of me. I still end up getting lost. <laughs> You nearly managed to drink that fire resist, though. Yeah, I, I had, was just finishing up the sipping noise and, and just... Nah. Bleh. Yeah, I should have made sure I had it on my hot bar. But I, I thought that, like, well, I already had more than my share of my bad luck, so I probably met my quota for today. But apparently, uh, my quota has no limits. No. <laughs> Unlimited credit. <laughs> Yep. Unlimited bullcraft. All day, every day. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Yes. Hitting back down the ladder. I'm gonna have to go do some more mining again pretty soon. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, cause gotta get back all the stuff that I lost again. <laughs> I think I know where I am. Yeah, we've been here before. Oh, I see the ladder. Yay! Yay! There's another chicken down here. Dang chickens. <laughs> yep. I always get them so I can get their feathers if they're in reach and stuff. I see you. Hey! Yay! Hmm. Okay. Hello! Well, that was an interesting... an interesting adventure. Yep. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm? Hmm. Hmm. Thank you. Sorry? Right. Yeah. I'm probably going to be needing these. <laughs> With my kind of luck. <laughs> uh, do you want to set back off again, or have you had enough for today? Um. Don't mind. Like I said, I'm probably gonna have. Well, I'm I'm probably gonna go spelunking. That's a good idea. Cover material. Good plan. Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, we got a little bit. We got two two stacks and an eleven, so that's not bad. Would have been twice as much. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, <laughs> it's fine. Yep. I'm not looking forward to doing the branches on this tree to try yeah. and make it look not derpy. Hmm. I don't know. Um. I got. I cleared away all the nether rack up there, so that's a uh -huh. that's a start. Yep. Uh. So yeah, we've now got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven and a bit stacks of glowstone for uh, for the project. So that's quite a bit more. We're getting there. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we kind of want to have some branches going from the tree sort of along uh, across the bedrock. Uh, oh, yeah, that'll definitely here and there be cool. To kind of hold it up. And then I guess we'll just put a lot of glowstone in there to make it look sort of leafy mm -hmm. um, and stuff. 
I'd say you can probably kind of just follow the contours of the bedrock because it's kind of, you know, uneven and mm. leafy looking as it is. Yeah, I want to leave the bedrock in view if that makes sense. So it's kind of a mixture of bedrock and glowstone for the leaves um, oh. as a sort of contrast, mm -hmm. uh, sort of a nether tree. Yeah, nether tree. Yeah, that'd be cool. Hmm. Cool. Where's your spelunking site then? Um, I pretty much went down to the uh, ladder under the uh, ocean. All right, uh, yeah. And uh, uh, kind of went the opposite way that someone else had been. Oh, okay. And just have been mining around down there at diamond level to get stuff. <laughs> That's cool. I'm just getting some fuel, by the way. You don't need to necessarily follow me. Oh, ouch! Okay. Oh, I heard that. Gas shot me while I was on the ladder. Oh, no. Probably broke the ladder. It did, but didn't destroy any of the ladder bits, so I actually managed to put them all back. Gas tier, oh, gas tier, gas tier, gas tier. Come on, come on, come on. Gas tier, gas tier, gas tier, gas tier. There's nothing here. Why is there nothing here? I'm on two hearts. Heal. Heal, boy, heal. Heal. <laughs> Oh, right, like heal, as in H-E-A-L. Yeah. I heard H-E-E-L. I was like, what? Well, yeah, well, I was using it <laughs> as a pun in that case. Yeah, but you just confused me like the first time, even before you said heal boy. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Ow. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm down here for fuel. I was just going to head back then. I'm here for fuel. Mm -hmm. Yes. See, I guess I'll go ahead and use my diamonds to make a wooden sword. Or not... Oh, that would be a terrible exchange. <laughs> diamonds for a wooden sword. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> diamonds to make a diamond sword. That way I have a fighting chance down there. There's a giant magma slime in the nether hub. Oh! He did. Yay! Do you drop uh, magma stuff? Not one. <laughs> Not a one. One of his XPs came through the portal. I got it. <laughs> really? <laughs> well oh, done. Oh yeah, all that XP I had before is also gone. No! Aww. And that silk touch on my, my max! No! No! <laughs> yeah, so much loss. All right. Yeah, I just lost all my stuff as well. Uh, but I had a bit more of a backlog, so I could recover a little faster. Mm -hmm. Yep. Whenever I'm just idling, I just go around and harvest stuff and put them in stuff chests. Stuffed chests? Yep. Like wherever there's stuff supposed to be. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, there's chest by the veggies, so I put veggies there, and, and then... Just kind of restocking then yeah yeah I, I do that sometimes when i have time mm -hmm. it's nice to give back yep i like to do <laughs> that i like having like responsibilities and stuff around yeah. here it makes me feel like part of the family <laughs> part of the family yep by george all right <laughs> no it's uh, i've i've found that um my favorite projects to do on a multiplayer server are group projects like uh, things that benefit everybody. Mm -hmm. um, so like farms and things like that are very fun to do because everyone can can use them. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, I find viewers quite like to see you do sort of solo projects as well on YouTube. So that's kind of why I've got this Rotten Flesh thing going because even though it's a solo project where the Rotten Flesh is powering my base, um, it kind of gives everyone else on the server something to do where they can get resources and diamonds and stuff for Rotten Flesh. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's kind of a bit of a community thing to it, even though it's not. <laughs> yep, that's a good thing to do. Oh, there's a spot for sugar cane. I've been putting it in that other miscellaneous grab box because that's the only place I saw it before. But I might have just missed Mis it. Miscellaneous? Yeah, the, uh, uh, like, miscellaneous items <laughs> chest and the kind of community chests. I just like how you pronounce miscellaneous. Ah. <laughs> Didn't realize it was different. 
Oh, I, I say I say miscellaneous. Ah. But I don't know if it's an American difference thing. It quite possibly could be. I think it 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 varies by the area. I just yeah. I just kind of started pronouncing it that way because it has a C and nobody really objected and about half the people I meet say it that way and so. <laughs> Oh, well, um, fair enough. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know people, the, you, huh? Sorry. Uh, people. People around the U.S. all pronounce things different depending on the area. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Crazy Man takes uh, takes the mickey out of uh, Arafat and Jake all the time. <laughs> Whenever they say y'all, he goes, tee <laughs> <laughs> um, What were He's you? a very accepting man, is our Crazy Man. Seems like it. <laughs> and what were you gonna say earlier? Uh, I've forgotten. Oh no! See, that's was... why I stopped. <laughs> it was something. Oh yeah, you know, you know the word. Um, actually. Mhm. Mm I used to pronounce it actually. Actually. <laughs> actually. Um, which I think is my mum's fault because uh, we're obviously all from Switzerland and she pronounces it actually. And I, I had people laughing at me for a while before I trained myself to say it actually. Oh, uh, are you from Switzerland? No, uh, in England. Ah. Oh, but you're... Wait, what? I thought you said something about being from Switzerland. Yeah, but when I moved here. Oh. Because I, I do live in England. Oh, okay. So. But I did say from. I, th I thought I did. I meant to. <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> I was trying to ask if you were from Switzerland. Oh, yes, I am. Ah. I couldn't yeah. tell. But I'm no, not... No, I have a... I have a very strong British accent. Um, I don't really know why. <laughs> I guess I've just I I learned how to speak English like this. Um, my my dad is English, so I kind of learned from him as a child. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, I don't have an English accent when I speak Swiss, so that's nice. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's kind of nice. Like on one hand, it's it's nice not to be taken for a foreigner in my own country. But at the same time, if I make a mistake with grammar or uh, with, like, there's there's different formalities. Like, um, I don't know if you've ever studied German. There's the there's the do form, uh, which is, like, informal. And there's also a formal tense. Mm -hmm. And I occasionally forget to use the formal tense. And because I don't have an accent, it sounds like I'm just intentionally being rude. Ah. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, that there's good and bad to that. It's mm -hmm. like um I used to like I'm trying to just sort of in informally here and there learn some Japanese. Uh I've kind of had to stop ever since I've become ill because I just don't have much me mental capacity and memory. No. Uh, so it's like most things I try to learn end up getting wasted cuz then I forget them. <laughs> um but from what little I was learning, I was super good at uh, speaking it with the native Japanese accent. All the Japanese people I mm. spoke to said, wow, you sound exactly like you are Japanese when you speak it. Um, but uh, I found out, though, that since I knew so little of it, I mean, I don't even know the basic grammar rules much, um, that I shouldn't speak it that way because mm -hmm. then people will think that I'm fluent. <laughs> Uh, yeah. So I've kind of had to untrain myself from speaking it proper sounding. And now when mm -hmm. I try to, I can't do it anymore. I'm like, aw. Oh, no. <laughs> There's a well, block I'd... of water on top of the uh, brewer. Yeah. How'd that happen? Um, We put a block of ice there um, and then melted it with a torch and it oh. didn't update. <laughs> So as long as you don't place any blocks next to it, uh, it will just stay there forever. Right. And it's for filling up the bottles. Because if, um, if you've got, say, a stack of six bottles, uh, empty bottles, and you want to fill them up with water, and you don't have six spaces in your inventory, the bottles fly out. So if you try and fill them from the ocean, they pop into the ocean if you have yeah. not enough space for them. So the idea of the water block is you can look up and right-click and fill from there. And if you don't have enough inventory space, they'll pop out onto the floor rather than into the ocean. Okay. Yeah, I'm just swimming in it. <laughs> just bobbing around up and down, looking around at everything. <laughs> I, know. I do that all the time. <laughs> so that's what that's for. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Well, good. Let's go down and do some splunking.
splunking. I used to not think that was a real word. I thought people were just like saying it to sound funny or something. <laughs> and then I found out it's an actual thing. I'm like, no way. <laughs> yes way. <laughs> I'm so glad I put fence posts everywhere. Much, much easier to get stuff if you're, if you died and all of it went in the ocean now. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of a bit of a downside to living in the ocean. Mm -hmm. If you die, it's hard to get stuff back. Yep. There's always slimes on the way down the ladder up here. Yeah, well, that's a slime farm. Oh, that explains it. Have you gone around the corner into that little room? No, I haven't. Sort of halfway down the ladder, there's a little side passage, mm -hmm. and it's a slime farm. So it's it's. Um, do you know what a chunk is? Uh, yeah. Certain chunks can spawn slimes, and others can't. It's kind of just determined by the by the seed of the world. Um, so that particular room is exactly one chunk wide, and it is a slime chunk. So it's got lava in all the corners and hoppers. Um, so you can, avoiding the lava, look in the hopper and it usually has slime balls in it because the slimes die in the lava. Ah. Oh. Yep. I was just looking at it. There's, well, I think there's a bunch of mushrooms there, though. Yeah, it's, it doubles as a mushroom farm. Oh, okay. Um, have you guys been, like, using mushrooms for anything in particular? Not really, no. Um... We've been hoping to find a, a mushroom island, but haven't yet. Ah. Oh. How many I... how many slimes do we have in the hoppers? They're under the water. I... Oh, it's forty four in there. Sweet. This basically just runs constantly if somebody's up in the hub. There's a stack and three in there, so this is just like a joint store, a joint farm. So if you need slime balls or mushrooms, you can come down here. The mushrooms on the cobblestone are like the seed mushrooms, and then the ones on the smooth stone are the ones which have just grown naturally so you can sort of pick them up um mm -hmm. and leave the the seed ones and they'll keep oh i see producing yeah more. it helps keep them organized yeah <laughs> this was like one of my first projects mm -hmm. that's cool um how are they growing with all this light here though they uh there's a well that's why the light is in the ceiling um so that it's not too bright in fact, the ones on the edge here might not be growing. I hadn't thought about that because they might be too bright. I can't remember. There's a certain light level. Mm -hmm. Well, sometimes if it's too light of a light level, they just pop out of the ground and won't stick, period. Yeah, yeah. That, it, that's... I guess it might depend on what order they were put in or something. If I, I don't have any torches on me. If, if you put a torch down right next to one of these, they will pop off if you want to try it. Yeah. Yep. So there is a ma minimum light level sort of thing. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that was sort of a little project I did a while ago. Mm -hmm. And the fence post was supposed to stop the slimes from wandering off down the ladder, but it doesn't seem to work. <laughs> Since yeah, they, seeing, uh, I think they I, go I underneath. I run into them all the time when I'm going up and down the ladder and just kill them and collect slime balls <laughs> to Fair toss enough. in the chests. <laughs> I don't know what's over here. I think this was my first attempt at finding a cave. Uh, oh, there's... Uh, ladder... <laughs> Bleh, uh, oh, wrong side. Eek, there. Oh, this is... Oh, this is Jake. Jake did this. Uh, there's, a, there's a zombie farm over here somewhere. I think. I heard something about a zombie spawner underneath of the uh, ball of crafting tables or something yeah that's this i think it's huh. down here yeah here it is so they've been using this to convert villagers um convert zombies into villagers so the spawn is just behind that leaf block and they get a minecart and pick it up with the minecart check if it's a villager and if it is they they cure it and send it up this um water chute huh. um which takes it up to the actual workbench platform or if it's just a zombie, they just kill it, so... <laughs> huh. um, does it collect drops or anything? No, it's um, it's just, Cause... just for getting villagers. Hmm. 
Note to self, find a way to dig in there and collect zombie drops for zombie flesh for diamonds, tee hee hee. <laughs> as soon as somebody does that, the price, for uh, the diamond to flesh ratio is going to go up. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. I don't know how to do that, so I'm going to just keep doing it the old-fashioned way for now. I mean, I need fuel for my... I, what, what, what is this? Oh, it's the oh, it's just the way back up. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't been down here in a while. I need fuel for my farm, so I'm happy for people to um, to farm the flesh and sell it to me. I'll just reduce the price uh, mm -hmm. that I'm offering because its value will decrease slightly. Yeah. It's, at the moment, it's very rare, so that's why I'm kind of offering a stack for a diamond because that's a not a bad price because it's mm -hmm. quite difficult for people to get hold of it at the moment. But as soon as somebody has a zombie farm, that price will probably drop. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Well, I'm a go adventure and dig and see if I can find some more diamonds or at the very least uh, iron. Okay, I'm donating potions. <laughs> I'm going to do some brewing and uh, make some potions ready made cool. at the hub. Cool.